Hey guys, welcome back. Carter Bitsby tripping back in the farm. We were out here until about midnight last night getting some of these things set up. Get them ready really for their connections. want to prime it. See these little valves. Getting everything set and prepped essentially. So going in there and making sure we have the right cleaning done getting the pre-pipe set this is schedule 80 pvc i had some people reach out going hey what's what's the the difference between the standard pvc and these a little thicker so that's what makes it a little more expensive now one of the other things i want to address too is i've seen some of the comments out there and people are like dude like eip 1515 mine just went live what's this mean for eth profits and we'll have a video on that we'll show kind of what the reciprocation of that is i know several other channels right now are going to be covering this you know, with us doing this right now, it's not been the real big priority. We're looking always in the future when it comes to GPU mining. Been doing this for a very long time, since 2010, doing GPU mining with just a few GPUs on Bitcoin. I've went through multiple iterations of options when it comes to proof of work, when it comes to GPU mining. And I've went very long on GPU mining. BBT Todd's went very long on GPU mining. We believe in GPU mining of not just from proof of work standpoint, but the versatility that GPUs bring to you. Also with not just resale value and a hedge in a space that has a lot of volatility, the GPU core cost actually stays pretty relative to what their original cost was. And it isn't just a supply demand dynamic there. So there's a, there's a lot more than just YOLOing into a large farm like this or doing a big upgrade like this that looks at a, a lower cost of maintenance cooling, more efficiency. We're looking at it a long-term plan and we don't see GPU mining going away. Why profits may come down some because ETH will eventually go to proof of stake. That doesn't mean that GPU mining is gonna go away. I think there's a huge amount of interest in this space. There's also the straight fact that proof of work has not been replaced. And I don't foresee that anytime soon. Proof of stake is a different way of doing things and we'll see if it ends up being a more efficient, better governance. You don't have huge conglomerates. These are all things that are theory right now that we don't actually see. We see Matic and a few of these other ones that are more centralized. You're trading part of the trilemma for that. And I think ultimately people are still gonna have GPU mining for some coins and that's always gonna be what it is. So we're going long on that and that's okay. Like some people do not wanna take the risk for that and they'll go proof of stake and that's fine. But to give everybody an understanding of why we would spend the time and money and the effort to go through all this and look at the efficiency, we're looking you know, five years, 10 years out on this stuff. The same as when you make an investment like this, you gotta look for the longer term here. You can't be fly by night, very emotional with the markets. And that's where I'm kind of going with it. Anybody that's going through this kind of effort, you gotta have that, that understand what's coming, understand the system in general, and have confidence in what you're doing with this stuff to know that you're gonna be a service provider. And those there are gonna be some times that it's not always gonna be super profitable. Now this was just a real quick video to cover a couple of those questions that I saw come through yesterday. And we'll have a longer overarching kind of, I wouldn't call it a documentary video, but we're gonna take this entire build and put it into one larger video at some point, once we're at least done with these two tanks. So for the people that are like TLDR bro, just give me the final point, that will come. So you guys stick around, like, subscribe and share. That helps us get this content out to people, helps us get exposure to this space in general, which we obviously love very much. And you guys hang out and we'll see you guys on the next one.